creating defined arcs or arcs with random starting and ending points is very easy using the ellipse tool or circle tool in Corel Draw. We'll start by selecting the ellipse tool. We'll hold down the control key to constrain the dimensions so we get a perfect circle. Draw a circle on our screen. Now in order to manipulate this so we can make it an incomplete circle uh, and an arc with a defined starting and ending point, we'll click the shape tool over here on the left side of your screen. With the shape tool selected, you'll be given some options up top. We want to convert this circle to an arc. Once we do that, you'll end up with an open section and it will define your starting and ending points here. With your shape tool, you can manually click and hold and drag the starting and ending points to wherever you like on either the left side or the right hand side of the arc. Alternatively, in these boxes, we can set a starting and ending point. In this case, we'll start at zero degrees and we'll end at 180. Also, let's try it at 90 degrees, ending at 180, and now 90 degrees, ending at 360. And this is a two different ways that you can create a circle, convert it to an arc, and define your starting and ending points, or just drag it manually.